by Arachnicus Varius. You want to put that in English? It's the yellow bellied sap sucker. Okay. I just came in early to work on a couple of prints. What are you doing here? I guess I fell asleep in class yesterday. What time is it? Uh, it's about uh, 7 o'clock. Are you serious? It's 7? I gotta put on my makeup! Touching hands Hey, Mr. Kayla, is it alright if I use it darker? Oh. Thank you. Yeah? What? What do you see? Oh my gosh! Hey, Captain Brown, sorry I'm late. I ran into a bear. 
Oh, please don't call me Captain. Call me Starshot. Take a seat. The students, as you know, all my life I studied war. In fact, I disliked civilians so much I quit going to see my parents during the war in Vietnam. But when I retired from the Navy after 27 years, I came here to teach at Blacksburg High School, and I came to realize that it's all about love. Love is the only truth. Everything else is a lie. We were just talking about the French surrender in World War II, which was much like their previous surrenders. Would you like to contribute? Um, I, uh, uh... Well, I was just saying that the French surrender was totally brilliant because love is really all you need. Wait, uh, how can a surrender be brilliant? Well, I'll tell you why, Luke, because war is a pointless thing in the first place. All those bombs and guns and soldiers, it doesn't mean anything. Love is all you need. War is just bad, man. Peace. Uh, Cap, I mean, Starshine? Are you okay today? Yeah, man. Everything is groovy. So I just started talking about the different types of conversation that we have in day three molecules. Chuck, what's going on, man? Actually, I prefer when people call me Charles. AP chemistry was so easy. If you actually listen in class, then you know what's going on. I'm not your teacher, Ms. Davis, for that. Ask her. Uh, Ms. Dana, can I go to art to work on my project? No, you can't, Luke. You know why? Because I don't ask you to do chemistry in art class, so why should you be doing art in chemistry class? Hey, Ms. Dana? Yes? Uh, can I go to the bathroom? Yes, go. Okay. What? Meet me in my after the way I've been treated. The way you've been treated? What are you talking about, Mr. Stick? Look, you just don't get it. Yeah, Odell rules! <laughs> hey, what's happening here? Oh, excuse me, young lady. I'm not to take that. Um, no. Hey, Greg, could you hand me a coffee? Oh, sure, Mr. Dickinson. There you are. Thank you very much. 
monster. Hey! Ever since I came here, I've been pushed around and picked on. You know, the silly name calling, hey, twig, and stick in the mud, and your dad a branch, and I can't even log on to the computer without somebody making a joke on that. Basically, I'm just trying to take back what's rightfully mine. So, I conjured a lightning storm, choked in a wormhole, propelled Blacksburg High into a parallel universe. Then, I captured Mr. Dickinson and the other administrators. Now, my master plan is in full effect. You're looking at your new principal, Gregory Stick. But somehow, Luke, you escaped my wizardly grasp. This leaves only one question. What are you going to do about it? Well, actually, I kind of like it like this. Everyone in this universe is more laid back, and I was getting kind of tired of the old administrative regime, but I don't think I'm going to do anything. I'm just going to let it happen. By the way, what's with the cloak? Oh, it, it's a personal thing. So what are your plans from here? Well, I don't really know. I'm just enjoying not being picked on anymore. Yeah, way to really stick it to him. Get it? Stick? Am I right? <laughs> Omnipotence is a lonely business. 